Howdy guys, what is up? Steph from Texas here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video. Um, today's video is such an exciting video because this is something very like scary to do. Very ridiculous of me to even like think of doing. Like I literally wanted to film myself like cutting my bangs last time. But look, they like messed up. It would have been such a good video. But anyways, I do have bangs and like I don't know how this is going to turn out because of them. If you haven't read the title, I will be dyeing my hair today, but temporarily. I found this. It was literally on clearance. So it either worked really bad or it's just... I don't know what's wrong with it, but it was on clearance. I actually got this for five bucks. It's from L'Oreal Paris colorista that's what it's called it's semi-permanent color i got it in the shade burgundy 20 i don't know it's gonna be like a purple shade it says it's for dark brown to light brown hair do not use if you're naturally blonde or bleach blonde and my tips like are actually a little bit blonde so i'm very scared for that i don't think i should be doing this to my hair because it will damage it anything for my channel we're just gonna go with the flow whatever happens happens and let's stop chattering and just get right into the video okay so it says it's easy application we're gonna see how easy this is i should be doing this in my restroom but my restroom has like some weird sound going in the background and i can't like turn it off because then the light will be off and it's just a big mess so we're not gonna do that no normal person would go to the restroom and do it there but um we don't follow rules <laughs> so this is the packaging i never showed you i think i showed you i don't even know it says shampoo and dry hair fully use gloves um avoid the scalp leave for 30 minutes for best results so i probably will end up leaving it for longer i don't know if that's gonna like damage it even more oh my god um then it says rinse hair thoroughly with water see, see instructions for complete instructions okay so this is what you get out of the box it comes with an applicator so that's good and then with some instructions okay so like i never even read instructions and i don't think anyone does but for this we're gonna have to because i don't want to damage my hair even more fun it comes with a lot of gloves this is way too many it's like if they think there's gonna be like 20 people helping me do this like i'm literally just one person like why would they add that Step 1. Shampoo and towel dry hair. To prevent staining clothes, cover your shoulders with the dark towel or dark t-shirt. So I'm just going to keep on this one. It's a really old t-shirt, so it's not going to mess it up or anything. But um, does it have to be damp? Like, it just says towel hair dry. Okay, so I think it's just dry. I did wash my hair this morning. Second step, choose the sections of your hair you want to color. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, so pretty much it's whatever the box said. I don't know why they have to add all these instructions. I do want to color all my hair, but I don't know how it's going to look. And then the ends, like, they're blonde. I did watch, like, some other YouTubers do this already. They ended up putting Vaseline on the side of their, like, face so, like, it won't stain them. Well, that's what I'm going to do. I'm so scared. We're just going to, like, go right into it. Like, oh, my gosh. This is a pretty color. I hope it does actually show up because if not, I'm going to be mad. But we're just going to do it everywhere. I should have used a brush. I think it's actually going to show up. I don't know. I feel like it will. I have faith in this. Sorry, I'm watching like myself in a mirror. I forgot to mention that. Great, I just stained my face. Do y'all see that? That's not supposed to happen. That is great. I got it on my hand now too. Uh, I should have told my mom to do this for me. This actually has a lot in the bottle. I thought it was going to be like a little bit. Okay, I just smelt it and it smells pretty bad. <laughs> Like, technically, it should wash off, but, like, what happens, like, if it doesn't? Like, can I sue them? If this actually works, I don't know what color to do next. Okay, my neck already got stained, too. Like, who even let me do this? This is, like, the bottle at the end. I used all of it. I think I was supposed to use all of it. Since these are sticky, I feel like I should switch them. 
Maybe that's why they give you a lot because they know that it gets sticky or something. And hopefully it comes out because look, this might look like a hickey to like my students or something. That's embarrassing. So now we're gonna leave it in for 35 minutes. So I'll come back once it does ring and we'll see what happens. <laughs> This was a bad idea. <laughs> Everyone's sleeping, so it's really hard for me to blow dry my hair. Throw away the instructions. Like, I should have never done that. And now my hands are stained. My neck is still stained. My scalp is literally, like, colored too. Like, just pray for me, guys. I don't know why I did this. I guess I'll see y'all tomorrow to see what happens. The next day. Sorry, I'm not wearing makeup, but... I wanted to show you my hair like you really can't like tell I don't know it's just a whole mess like I don't think I'm ever gonna try this again like I I'm just like so irritated I thought it was gonna look cute and stuff I mean I still like it but it's not like showing up as I wanted to so let me just show you how it turned out can't really tell like at the top my scalp is actually like you can see that like and even if I try to fix it, like, even over here. So, I think what I need to do is wash my hair since yesterday. I just said to, like, rinse off and stuff. So, I didn't really wash my hair. Um, I think that's the problem with that. So, we'll see. I'll try to check in back later after I wash it. See how it goes. See how it looks. I mean, other than that, like, I kind of do like it because it's the tips. But, like I said, I had dyed, bleached, or whatever my tips. So, I'm really scared that the dye is not going to go away or something. I don't know like that's gonna be bad not sure whether to like it or not because of the scalp situation but honestly it feels really sticky too that's another thing i don't like it's really sticky and my hair looks wet but it's not wet it's actually dry i think i'm just gonna wash my hair and just hope for the best later okay guys so a little update i just came out of the shower and my hair actually feels a lot better now. I actually did put shampoo in it. Supposedly that's how I get the color out. But honestly, I was just irritated with my scalp like looking like stained and stuff. But as you can see through the middle part, it's not that stained anymore. It was like worse than what it is right now. It just looks kind of pink. But if I go to the side, like you can still see staining right there. So I can't really do my part down the side i have to do it down the middle which kind of sucks but it's fine it's better than what it was before the number one thing that i hate about this is that it's staining my towel so i'm gonna have to buy a new towel that kind of sucks but i only think it showed up because of my tips that were blonde two weeks later hey guys so i'm so sorry it's actually been about two weeks since i haven't updated y'all on my hair and i just want to say i'm so impressed by this whole product who knew that this even existed i've always wanted to try out like different color hair but i'm so scared that it's not gonna look good and i'm just gonna mess up my hair so this being temporarily was so cool and i'm pretty sure i will try out another different color let me give you all the rundown of all my likes and dislikes about this product so i actually love that they have different colors they have from like blue to pink to green to gray many other different colors but you get the point there's a lot of colors that you can try out um it's actually really cheap well i found that in clearance but it was like five bucks which is really cheap and really cool to try out and you get to just play around with it it was easy application one of my first downs that i hated was that it stained my scalp it stained my towel really bad i had to buy a new one so adding to that was that since it did stain my towel i do believe it will stain your pillowcase if you do sleep with your hair wet which i never did throughout the whole process just like my towel got stained anything will get stained i don't think any of my clothing got stained which was good because i was scared of that too and other than that i think those were all the highs and the lows about this i did have fun doing this whole project something i will say is that i don't know if this will work with dark hair i do think the tips only showed up because i have blonde tips as you can tell and you can still see some of the red tint like right there i don't know 
it's like brown brownish so i'm sorry if you go out and buy this and you have dark hair and it doesn't work it wasn't me i promise um just like i told you it's my blonde tips that actually got the color my top of the head didn't so i don't know how that would turn out for you guys it's so cheap it's so fun to do and it only lasts about two weeks i really noticed that wherever you focus the shampoo is where the color is gonna go away so sometimes i would just skip doing the shampoo down here because i didn't want the red tips to go away so that's one tip i will give you like the longer you want it, the less shampoo you put on here because with water, it didn't really come off. If you do try this out, please comment down below and comment down below what color I should do next. And if you did enjoy this video, please make sure to give me a big thumbs up. I guess I'll see y'all next time with another video. Peace.